Temperature wise, we're into the 30s in Sandpoint, Deer Park, Kettle Falls, 41 degrees in Spokane, 41 in Pullman. We've got 46 in Ritzville, 48 in Moses Lake, and 51 degrees right now out towards Moses Lake. When you take a look at the uh, jet stream and the satellite, there's the next big weather system right there. And this is the one we thought was going to move into our area. Most of it, though, is going to move over the north of us, but we're still on the fringe of seeing some of these showers right here across northeastern Washington and and northern Idaho. So your future tracker computer model has some snow in the northern Cascades, mostly dry weather though, east of the Cascades. Then we get a few snow showers moving in across the mountains of northern Idaho and western Montana tomorrow morning at 7 o'clock. We've got clouds in the Spokane area. We'll get some clearing at time, especially as we get later on into the day. This is at 5.30 in the evening, and that will bring us improving weather for Thursday and Friday. But tomorrow, I think there's a chance we could see some sprinkles, of some flurries uh, across the Spokane and surrounding areas for tomorrow. Temperatures will still be on the mild side, though. Mid 40s out towards uh, central Washington. We'll look for a high of only 39 in Deer Park and a low of 20. So it still gets pretty cold there, but we should get up to 44 in Spokane after a morning low of 25. 38 expected in Newport, 38 in Sandpoint, 42 in Coeur d'Alene. Partly cloudy in Colville and 43, 41 in Pullman and Lewiston. We'll see a daytime high of 48. Here's a look at your seven day outlook. We'll go from 47 to 50. So now we get into the 50s. Friday, we still could see a very warm day with a high of 58. But then we have a weak weather system moving in on Saturday. Drops our temperatures quite a bit. Back down to about 49. And even though it says a 10% chance of precipitation, we could see a few sprinkles or snow flurries on Saturday as well. 48 on Sunday. And then we're back closer to seasonal temperatures for Tuesday, Monday and Tuesday of next week with highs in the mid 40s. But again, that's still above the average high of 42 for this time of year.